2K Sports and the Corn Ferry Tour are delighted to welcome you to today's event. Today's coverage of the Fellowship Open is about to start. Pleased you could join us for this second round action. I'm Luke Elvie alongside Rich Beam and Rich, as this player starts their round in the lead, what should be their focus for today? Small leads are no fun because you think that you should win, you kind of expect to win, but you know that there's some good golf that must be played to get you over the line. I gotta say, small leads are just uncomfortable. Well, it's set up for an exciting event. Can't wait to get into this. Let's see what kind of tone he sets for himself today. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? I'd say he's about 165 from this flag. All right, we're going with an extra club here. Not a bad approach, that one. Not quite inside the birdie range, but you never know. Hull a long one. Still counts. What's in front of them, Henny, with this part? It's 13 feet out. Unlucky for some, this is their look at birdie. Rolling end to end, it's looking nice. Look at him just surging ahead at the top of the leaderboard. Fantastic start right out of the gate. He's currently sitting in first place. Here we are at the second tee. Nice birdie in the last hole for a change. First one of the day. They needed it desperately. Now, next hole, looking for more. Oh, well done. Playing this shot from about 230 yards out. Wind is blowing from right to left here. Wants to work it against the wind. Seems to have chosen the three wood. Oh, I like the courage here, Rich, getting after this par five in two. As they should. What a play. Hopefully they'll be rewarded for that play. Looks good off the blade. That's making a big statement here today. Setting the tone early in this round. Currently 12 under for the event. Teeing off here at the third hole. Going with the five iron here. He 
Nicely done. This putt from around 18 feet. Tracking. Oh, terrific. What an effort. This guy is putting the lights out of it this week. Currently in first position. Teeing off here at the fourth. That drive heading straight towards the cut stuff. Going for less club here. And not a bad approach. He'll be putting. Now, this is a challenging one. A lengthy putter waits. Looking for another birdie here. What a putt to make. Well done. Two in a row there, Luke. Getting their groove on. Well, that's worth reviewing. Let's roll the video tape. I could watch this one all day. Who would have thought that would go in? Now six shots in front after that hole. Here we find ourselves on the tee of a par four. That reminded me of the big easy, silky smooth. Second shot here on the fifth. Going with the pitching wedge here. <laughs> Terrific approach and a chance for a birdie here on the fifth. Just four feet remaining between him and the hole. He's staring down a birdie putt here. The putt is underway. You can mark it down. That's birdie number four today. Got to say, putting this well from this distance is a huge confidence booster. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Looking to ride the momentum after coming off a birdie here with this shot.
that was absolutely murdered. Setting up in the first cut here. Going with the 9-iron, nine I think. Wow, did this come out beautifully. Yeah, you hit a beauty, didn't you? A birdie putter waits. Ooh. And just a little bit of clean-up work remaining on this hole. Our current leader is enjoying a six-stroke advantage. Time to take a look at what this par four might be in order. What a drive. Look at that. And Henny, what's he looking at here? He's got, oh, I'd say roughly 120 here. Well, good looking shot here. That's headed towards the green. Oh, stop it. What a shot. Trying to get to 16 under with this putt. Oh, that's a nice line. Yeah, they're good momentum makers, those ones. Good putt for birdie. And there's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. Let's see what happens here at the eighth. Looks like they've got the five wood. Well, that'll work up on the dance floor. Could have been worse. Birdie at the last. This for another. This one's online. Okay, steady now. And this one is for his par. You've finished your work on that hole. Let's take a look at the next one. Our leader is up by a whopping six shots now. As we head now to the par five next. And after a par at the last, a chance to perhaps signal some intent. Tee shot is looking good here. One win is good, but two wins would be great.
Good shot there, Beamer. Getting ready to play their third. Breeze coming right into his melon. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. That one should find the surface. Well, got some sort of streak going on here. Greens in regulation. What a statistic. Another green in regulation. This is an absolute clinic. Yeah, it's just about three feet away. Now seven strokes up after that hole. We have a par four on this one. Oh, that sounded absolutely flushed. Henny, how's that ball lying? It's tough to see from here. Not the best tee shot, but they got lucky with this lie. Chosen the pitching wedge here. Oh, well played. And this putt is for birdie three on the scorecard. Oh, so close. That'll sting a bit. Big putt for par coming up. In she goes. Let's head to the next. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Time to tee off on the 11th. Watch that swing all day. That's beautiful. Playing from around 230 yards. Wind is blowing right to left here, and they're going to go ahead and ride the wind back to this pin. This one looks like it'll safely make the green. And here we are with the third shot. chance this one right on six feet their short game has been very impressive they've been really sharp today looking good that will drop and it will extend the lead
Leading by eight strokes now after that hole. Now on the tee, fresh off a of birdie. A great opportunity to build on that momentum. Really hoping they play this one aggressively. That swing reminded me of smooth jazz. Great rhythm. Time for the second shot at the 12. Oh, that's a high caliber shot. What have they got in front of them here, Henny? This one will run uphill. Just didn't drop. An opportunity to make a par here. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. It's time to take a look at this 13th hole. See if you can get that one to come back to the left a little. Okay, that'll work. 19 feet to the cup. This is what they have left for birdie here. This has eyes for the hole. Oh, just missed. Well, this would be a good one to make. It's for par. Well, that hole's behind us. More to play. Our current leader is up by a whopping seven shots now. Setting up now on a par four. Good shot there. It's a fairway finder for sure. Penny, what have they got in front of them here? Setting up here from about 155. Going with the eight iron here. This one's got eyes for the flagstick. Yeah, the wind's really starting to blow, but that didn't phase them. Eight feet to the cup. What a performance. Eight birdies on the card. And this is quality play. Still on top of the leaderboard.
And after a birdie at the last, they take the honour on the hole. That was wonderfully done. And what's in front of them there, Henny? Got to make sure to control the flight here because the wind was well, straight into their face. Going with a three wood here. Mm. That's right out of the copy books. Exquisite. And this one for back to back birdies. Six feet remaining to the cup. All right, guys. This for two birdies in a row got a chance that will work on a roll here with back-to-back -back birdies I like it two in a row he's feeling it he sits in first position let's see what happens here at the 16th That's a nice looking tee shot, that one. Well, that's not ideal. Finding the trees. And the pine needles can always be a 50 50 lie. Well, that was a strange one. Didn't see that happening. Well, Rich, in the thick stuff here, not a good spot to be. Looks to be going with the five iron. Oh, I didn't see this as possible. What a shot. That's a perfectly fine result hitting from a lie like that. What's in front of them, Henny? Has to put this one downhill. Oh yeah, this is tracking nicely. 
Ooh, right by the hole. An opportunity to make their par. Now, that's got to be frustrating. Hit such a great approach shot in, but wasn't able to convert. Our current leader is enjoying a six-stroke advantage on the tee of a par three. to have opted for the eight iron. And this is an extremely long putt. You might even have to hinge on this one. What a great opportunity here for a look at a birdie. Yeah, that one pulled straight off the blade. Getting ready to play their third. This one for Bogey. Yeah, this is looking nice. That was a gallant attempt. And this one will be for double bogey. Well, an untimely double by our leader, and the rest of the field's eyes have lit up. A chance to bounce back here. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. Here we go, Rich. We're at the lucky last, teeing off the 18th hole. A thing of beauty. <laughs> Playing this shot from about 170 yards out. Has the wind coming right into his face. Opting for the five iron. That's a shame. Just leaking left, that one. And that was a bit of a misfire. Wind is absolutely swirling in this part of the golf course. Let's see if we can get this one up and down for par. Well, you like the look of those hands. Judging it beautifully. And that's it for today. So, two rounds in the books, Rich. Not a bad little day's work, I think. No, and only two more to go. Looking forward to seeing what happens in the final 36. On behalf of Rich Beam, Henny Kuyak, John McCarthy, I'm Luke Elvey saying so long from 2K Sports.